Now, it's more than just residents getting ready. State and county officials are watching the weather closely as well. As our Sussex County Bureau Chief Evan Kozloff reports, one thing is for sure. If the storm does hit, people in Delaware want to be ready. WBOC took a ride through Sussex County on Wednesday to see how folks are preparing for the potential hurricane. We start in Oak Orchard, where the rain began about 11 Wednesday morning. The pier will be destroyed. We're joining Michael Lehman, who's been head chef here at Serendipity for 12 years. He says they face damage every time there's a storm. They've already started the process of moving items off the dock area just in case. I hope it goes out to sea because it's just going to mean extra work for us. It's going to be extra work. Next stop was Rehoboth Beach. Same gloomy weather and around noon, the same drizzle. Candace and Ken Shop of Cincinnati described the waves. They look wilder than, uh, than usual. They're huge and they come up behind you. We almost lost our shoes. <laughs> <laughs> Nonetheless, the shops along the avenue remained open on Wednesday as they try to remain business as usual. Rehoboth police say they're holding a briefing Thursday morning to decide if they're going to remove the benches and trash cans from the boardwalk. Meanwhile, right here at the Emergency Operations Center in Georgetown, they have been busy. This is the hub of sorts when it comes to hurricane preparedness. And they've been keeping a very close eye on that forecast. In fact, when we came in, staff was in the middle of a briefing with the National Weather Service. They also had folks come in to test their equipment and generators. Debbie Jones from the center says preparation is the name of the game. We've been lucky for a long time, and at some point, we're going to get a storm that, that matters and will affect us all. But I think um, being prepared is the key. All to make sure that the county and state stay safe this week. Well, obviously, this is very early on, and so a lot is to be seen about the severity of this hurricane. But WBOC will be out here all week, so just stay with us for all the latest.